Yo YouTube, what is up? This is Bowen here, and uh, finally got some gameplay from the new DLC, you know, Onslaught. Ooh, watch this. Start out the game, get into the game late. Oh, almost had a four-piece. It's okay. I clean him up, baby. But, um, yeah, so I finally got some decent gameplay, man. I've been trying all day long, but uh, the game's been uh, rubber banding really bad for most of the day. Really don't know why. Um... Yesterday was my very first day playing this game on uh, Xbox 360, and then uh, and it ran fine yesterday. Uh, it ran fine. There was like hardly no issues. Just like um, you know, I don't know. But uh, and then today, after I downloaded the the map pack, it seemed to um, seem to rubber band really bad. Um, and, and it was weird because it didn't do it the whole game. It only do it like maybe five eight times um a game which i know that sounds like a lot but you know that's only once every minute or something but uh you know i don't know but uh i finally yeah got one good game plan and then we were down when i got into it it was like what one 160 to oh how did i not get that kill oh <laughs> i think it was like 60 to like 100 or something but uh yeah, I joined in this lobby, and you know I'm a game changer. That's what I do. I change up the game on them. But, um, yo, I spray bullets like none other right here, and I just keep getting hit markers on people. But I can't see no one. No. <laughs> um, so let's talk about the map packs. Um, all of them pretty much play out to be pretty small maps. Um, fog definitely plays pretty small especially it plays the biggest in domination in team deathmatch and kill confirmed game modes like that it, it's it's a cluster let's put it that way it's a cluster um in domination it's not too bad because you know people are specifically going outwards but in like team deathmatch it's like you, like it literally like only p people use only like half the map for right now um Bayview is exactly like what I thought. People trying to snipe over by the trolley. People already know about the, you know, setting in front of the trolley and laying down going prone. Uh, it's kind of funny to watch someone getting scooted across the map by the trolley. And, uh, yeah. And then that map kind of, uh, that map kind of seems like a small octane to me. It's like, it's like, you know, like the four buildings in Octane and then it's like the four buildings in contain or in Bayview my bad and um, seems really weird uh, containment uh, every single time I played this played containment oh it was it was pretty bad and it wasn't really because of anything it's just because every single time I joined into the game my my teammates were just I mean no thumbs man how, how do you get five other players that have no thumbs uh, <laughs> It was like it always goes. It's why I don't play Domination anymore by myself because I run to a flag. I sit there and like kill like half or more of the enemy team and cap the flag all by myself. And then I go to go to another flag because, you know, my whole team has died. So then they spawn there on the flag that I capped. And I'm like, oh, okay, you guys are going to camp that flag. So, you know, I'll go to a different one. And then I go to a different one. And by the time I get over to the next one, you know, the other team's already taken that one again. And then, of course, I cap the next flag I get to. You know, I got to slay four or five people. I cap that flag. And then my whole team dies. They spawn on top of me. They all sit there in corners, and they never move. And, I I mean, I don't get it. I thought it was only, you know, I don't know. I just, it, it's kind of weird. Ooh, I got kind of lucky there. Um, I didn't even actually see that dude. Uh, the Maverick. Let's talk about the Maverick gun real quick. The Maverick gun, uh, really do not, uh, it's hard to say whether I like it or not, because, like, the only time I played it, I could obviously tell I was way behind in the lag, um, people had a big advantage over me, and then, um, I, I started going back to using, like, the MTAR and sniping, and then it finally started to get better, so I probably need to hit back up the, uh, Maverick. It seems like a really decent gun, I played with it in, um, bots, it seems, uh, Overall a good gun. Of course, I did have red dot and grip on it. I never experimented without grip 
Um, that's like a must have pretty much in my in my book is grip so I never even play with a gun unless I can have grip uh, it seemed like there was little to no recoil just like most other um, assault rifles it seemed like the damage fell off um, out of range quite a bit but uh, like I said you know that could have just been because of the lag and um, yeah so the last map what what map did i not talk about we talked about fog containment baby oh ignition all right um ignition isn't too bad it uh still it, it actually surprisingly played really similar to scrapyard um my experience from remakes was they actually like like uh, I, I always felt like firing range played way different from Black Ops to Black Ops 1 because of all the different perks and attachments that had changed. Um, but I feel like uh, Modern Warfare 2 and Ghost is a lot closer, uh, similar game to each other than what Black Ops and Black Ops 2 was, you know, compared to each other. But, uh, ooh, drop down on him. Yeah, so uh, the maps are good. They, they play kind of small. Um... You know, I think that's what a lot of people wanted, and um, or at least the overall majority. And yeah, so you know, that's that's a first day review right there. Um, we are, I I think a lot of people are having problems with the like rubber banding and the lag. Um, I think that is just like a DLC issue though. Um, hopefully they'll hopefully they'll fix it in the next you know four and a half months. Who knows? But uh, yeah, comment, like, subscribe. Peace, guys. I'm out of here. See ya.